Mr. Blue here. <laughs> He's not sure he wants to hold still. They are very excited at the moment. Blue is, I would say, a very middle range puppy. Um, so as far as size goes, gray is the biggest and then blue and orange are very similar. Um, but as far as energy level, dominance, temperament, all those kinds of things, um, I would say that blue is very middle range. Um, again, these puppies are all so, so similar. They were all so similar when they were born and they've really just kind of held that similarity. At this age, there are starting to be a few differentiations. Energy level, I would say they're all about the same. There's not one that's really calm. There's not one that's really hyper. Um, you know, that more seems to vary from moment to moment within the day. Not necessarily a consistency there that one's more active and one's more calm. Um, so energy, they're all about the same. And as far as dominance, again, I would say they're all about the same. By, by dominance, I'm meaning um, like wanting to be in control of a situation. So, you know, these puppies, they all vary in their playing and their wrestling matches. They all take turns being on top and they all take turns being on bottom. There's not one that seems to always be controlling a situation or one that seems to always be submitting. Um, so again, that's just a thing that just kind of seems to vary from moment to moment throughout the day. Um, so, you know, energy and dominance, I would call them very similar. Where I am seeing some differentiation is um, in how timid or confident they may be. And I would still label all three of them middle range in that, but I am seeing some variation um, in how they react to new situations and noises, for example. We don't have a vacuum because we have all hard floors, but we have noticed like when we start up um, the lawnmower, or the other day when Adam started up the air compressor, the puppies reacted quite differently to that um, new experience and a loud noise. So Orange was curious and actually approached the noise. Um, and Blue just held his ground and stayed where he was as he investigated it. And Gray retreated until he had observed the situation and decided how to handle it. Um, so I am seeing some variation there in personalities. Um, and again, there's not a right or wrong, but you know, Orange seems to be a very confident puppy. And um, Gray seems not overly timid, but a little bit cautious. And then Blue is just kind of in between. Um, again, size-wise, Gray is a little bigger, but they're all very, very similar. None of them have white markings on them. Gray's lighter. Orange is darkest. Blue's in the middle. <laughs> I've never had a litter where the puppies were all so similar, so it's kind of a trick, even knowing what to say. Um, they all love people. You know, when we come in, they all come running and want to be held. They love, you know, people. All of them are willing to submit to us as people. You know, like, I don't know if he will right now because he's quite hyper, but you know, we quite frequently will hold them just like a baby. Ah, you like a baby. And, um, you know, they're very comfortable in that position. They don't resist it. They're happy to be petted on their belly, um, which is a dog's most vulnerable position to lay on the back and expose their belly. And, you know, so they all submit well to human um, and love people, love attention, love affection, all very similar that way. But so again, I, I wish I could say more. The biggest difference is how they react to a new situation that might be a little bit unsettling. <laughs> So here is Mr. Blue. They're all just cute, cute, cute as can be. We'll see if we can get him to look at the camera so we can get a close shot. Hey, see the camera? Yeah. yeah. Yes, you are, sweet boy. Okay, let's get one of your brothers. Uh, all right. Come here, boys. So they're wrestling right now. That is very normal puppy behavior. Even the growling, that is not um, something to be concerned about. That is one of the reasons it's important for puppies to stay with their litter and their mom. Um, it's how they learn kind of the rules of interaction there. So not anything to be concerned about. Um, anyway, we'll grab Orange right here <laughs> since he is the closest. He's also the most hyper at the moment, so we'll see if he'll hold still. Hey, Orange, can you say hi? Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. Can you smile to the camera? Huh? <laughs> so here's the orange boy. Again, his biggest differences from his brothers are his color is darker and he um, more confident and curious. 
he seems to be. <laughs> Not very, very hyper at the moment, huh? Doesn't want to hold still. There is Mr. Orange. Good boy. Okay, let's grab Gray while he's right here where I can reach him. Come here, Gray. Come here, man. And here he is Gray. He is lightest. Um, biggest at the moment, but still close enough in size to his brothers that I don't know at maturity that there's going to be a big difference. Um, but at the moment, he is biggest. His coat is lightest. His coat is also a little bit different texture than his brother's, um, which he's getting from his dad. He has a softer, it's like his hairs are thinner. Not less of them, but each hair itself is thinner and finer and softer. Um, he doesn't have as much of, I don't know if you call it an overcoat type of a, of a finish to his fur. So his fur is a little bit different. <laughs> he's lightest and he's biggest. Oh, you just playing with your chair. Oh my. <laughs> oh my. Um, and also he seems to be the one who wants to really study a situation out before he decides that he's going <laughs> to jump in on the fight. Huh, mister? That's right. All right. So um, that gives you a little shot of each of them. We'll maybe get some video of them playing so you can kind of see them in action. I wish I had more to tell you. They're all just so similar this time. Um, and if you have any questions, let us know. I'm gonna have to get my chair out of here before they eat it. <laughs> I'm on a chair because we just mowed the lawn. Didn't want to stain my pants. So I will move. Oh, don't get in the chair. Watch out. Gray's in it. Yep, there we go, Gray. There we go.